An Escondido man who recovered from coronavirus just made a potentially life-saving donation. 10 News reporter Michael Chen tells us how plasma like his could become a key weapon in the fight against the disease. Glad that this turned into a positive thing. Jason Garcia back in a hospital, this time to help others, all because of this. I tested positive for COVID-19. The aerospace engineer's first symptoms surfaced in early March, a cough and congestion, later followed by a headache, fever and body aches, and a trip to a hospital. More than a week later, a positive COVID test. He would spend nearly 10 days inside his home, confined to his office, staying away from his active duty Navy wife and their 11th month old daughter. His symptoms eventually subsiding. The letter from the San Diego County of Public Health uh, pretty much verifying that I, I completed the isolation requirements and I took that that letter and I kind of made a Facebook post about it. Around the same time, St. Joseph Hospital in Orange, California took to social media in search of those who had recovered to sign up for an experimental treatment. Then last week, Garcia found himself at that hospital ready to help. Nursing Director Wendy Escobedo explains why his plasma is so critical. Donating plasma to be transfused into a patient in our ICU that's COVID-19 positive and needs this for treatment. Within four days, all of his antibody-rich plasma had been given out to three different COVID patients. Garcia was told the patient in the worst condition has been taken off oxygen. At least the patient is improving, so that's, that's really promising. The use of blood from a survivor of a disease is a long-held strategy. Garcia among the first to donate his plasma in the fight against coronavirus. Help them fight the fight of their lives. Felt amazing. Michael Chen, 10 News. A great hope in that treatment. And the treatment is expected to be used for patients in dire need. The FDA has already approved several similar trials, including uh, involving COVID patients. The San Diego Blood Bank is asking survivors to donate plasma. Donors can find more information at sandiegobloodbank.org.